hello everyone welcome back in this video i'm going to show you how to make a impact log animation using adobe after effects so before starting this tutorial if you are new to my channel then please hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon to get all of my new videos notification and now let's have a look what we will create in this video So this is the animation we are going to make in this video. So to make this intro animation I am going to use these files. So you can download all of the files from the link in video description. Let's import them to After Effects. Now create a new composition. I am going with 1920 pixel by 1080 pixel and 30 frame rate per second. Rename it to main. And I am going to use duration 5 seconds then hit OK. Now let's drag the background back to this timeline and now let's import our logo. I'm going to use a free logo from Google. You can download any free logo from Google. Now drag this logo to this timeline. Press S to adjust the scale. I am going to set it to 18. Now select the logo, press pre-compose and rename it to logo.com. Select move all attribute to the new composition then hit OK. Now double click and again pre-compose it and rename it to logo holder. Select this and hit OK. Now in here drag this logo texture, drag this to below the logo holder and select this, click on this toggle switch option and make it to alpha mate and press S to open scale then adjust it something like this. Now turn on this then go to mode then make it to multiply. Now select this, go to effect and presets and search for gradient ramp, sorry, gradient wipe. Something like this. Now right click on logo holder, go to layer style then select bevel and emboss go to bevel emboss and change the size to 3 and change this highlight opacity to 50% close this now back to the main composition here is the problem so go to here Turn off the gradient wipe. Turn on this, then select this to the logo texture and make it something like this 30. Then back to the main composition, make it 3D. and select this press speed to open position go to something like here create a keyframe back to this point and make it something like negative 200 and something more okay Select all of this keyframe, press F9 or right click on your mouse, go to keyframe assistant, then make them as is. Click here and select this, make this something like this. Now let's see the preview. Let's make it more faster. Now 
okay now go to the project window drag the smoke explosion place it below the logo comp select this smoke ex explosion and click on this toggle switch make it to lighten and drag this to this point Select this, press T to open opacity and make it 60% or like 70. Now select the logo comp press ctrl d to duplicate it select this go to effect and press it and search for fill apply and again search for cc radial fastball apply it and change the fill color to black increase amount something like this and change this direction to something like this okay so now go to project window and drag the particle dust above all of this composition and now go to effect in pieces and search for levels make it little bit darker then change its mode to screen now select all of this composition and decompose them rename it to animation select move all attribute to the new composition then hit ok now select this go to effect and press it and search for wiggle position apply it select this press s and make it 110 go to this position where the logo touch the ground make it zero create a keyframe forward one frame and make it one then again forward two frame make it zero again now you can see that we have a shake effect to here. Now right click on your mouse, also make it 3D. Then right click on your mouse. Create a new camera. Go to first frame, press P to open position. Create a keyframe and go to the something like this point and make this something like this select all of this frame the frame then make them easy -ish. okay now let's see the preview so this is the animation we have make in this video Hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed, then make sure that you like this video and subscribe my channel for more videos. And and don't forget to share this video with your friends. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.